I am the architect. I've been waiting for you. Ben, Rock, what's poppin', what's poppin', so what's up? You've been doing so much. You got a lot going on. Your snapbacks is all over the place. What is about, what's about to happen with that? Are you trying to make 40 ounce like a, a new era? Is it gonna be like a big hat distributor? No nah, man, I'm, I'm gonna morph like the clothing line stuff. It's like I want I want a couple all angles with it. You know, the hat show was cool for the first year. You know, we lapped that quick. You know, looking forward to the next year, the next spring, summer. Or maybe some pieces here and there for fall winter this year, but aiming more for like spring summer to fuck the game up with that. Just cause you know, I like I very some fine things and you know, I get bored quick, so just dropping the hat every month and shit got boring to me already. So right. you know, I was taking it to the next level, next step. So is it gonna be like a full on clothing line? Like you gonna have like shirts, like you gonna have, have jeans, shirts. like we don't have jackets, we don't have hoodies, we don't have pullovers, we don't have crew necks, we don't have long suits, we don't have wagons. Oh, so like, you're gonna take over the streetwear game pretty much? I mean, pretty much. Pretty much, that's <laughs> what's about to happen. So like you had a whole bunch of collabs like Trap Star, you know, no, you did one with Def Jam, you have a whole bunch of Bench Row, you have a whole bunch of collabs with your hats. So is that gonna like, you know, are you gonna involve those collabs in your shirts? Can we expect like, you know, any of those with your I, clothing we, we might We might revisit a few of them, but I like to say, I like to keep things new. So we might, you know, I got a few more surprises up my sleeve, even though, you know. You ain't even got no sleeves, man. We ain't got no sleeves, but we'd always pull out them tricks, but expect some crap, you know. I don't really like speaking on things that I haven't signed off on yet, but there's a lot of things in the works. All right, cool. A lot. So what about, let's talk about 40 ounce Tumblr. Like, that's like the most scandalous Tumblr ever. It? I fuck with it. I love it, but I mean, that's, it's pretty scandalous. Are you trying to like make 40 ounce Tumblr like into a publication or anything? Like, I think you should like make it a magazine or something. Cause like, the ladies love 40 ounce. I yeah, don't know. everybody even asked me something physical. So it's like, it might be about that time to bring something printed or, or, or published. So. You never know. You might be able to own something for your coffee table soon. So it's coming. Something's in the works? I mean, you don't have something in your hands soon. All right. Sooner cool. or later. Cool, cool, cool. So what about your personal life? Like, we know you got a girl. How do you, like, maintain a relationship if Seven you're, like... Years. Yeah, Seven, like, if all the ladies are just throwing it at you all the time, what do you do? Like, how do you how do you guys keep that together? You just gotta know how to draw that line. You know, I might tiptoe and dance on the motherfucker, but, you know, sometimes... Just a little gotta, bit. You gotta draw the line. Also, your Twitter is kind of popping, just a little bit. It boosted. I, just a little bit I started. Popping. I started doing all this shit when I had like 2,000 followers. I see so you. So it's out like grind mode, grind mode. I mean, niggas think that Twitter shit is, it doesn't doesn't add up, but it does add up. So you think social network played a, a big role in your success? Of course. I, I wouldn't be here from if it wasn't for my MacBook. I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for Twitter, Tumblr. You know, these people creating these great interfaces and shit to do things with. That's what I took advantage of and that's what I built. I built everything from there. I hear you. So it's like, you know, shit is free. Why not use it if it's not if it's free? I don't want to pay nobody a monthly service fee or nothing, so. Word. So like, I mean, on your Twitter, you're always talking about what it's quiet for. Can you tell us what it's quiet for, what it's quiet for today and also it's what's quiet. wavy? What's wavy today, man? It's quiet for new cars, man. I know, so, this I'm, is wavy. <laughs> This is Wavy. I don't know if y'all see his car, but this car's amazing. Me. Car is popping out here. She's like as old as my parents. Man. So what is what's this car? Talk about it. What what kind of it, car is this? This is a motherfucking 1963 Chevy Impala. You know, I've gutted the whole thing. It's on new everything. It's a new 350 and a new transmission. And the body's moved down. You know, it's like my little. This is what I do when I get bored. I don't even know what none of that means. But I know this car is Wavy. This yeah, is a pop car. You gonna let me drive it? Of course. It's, 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 it's automatic, I trust you. Alright, cool, cool, cool. <coughs> what's, what's wavy? It's wavy today? What's out? Like, what kind of music is wavy? What are you fucking with today? What's, what's been on? What Actually, I, I got, I was listening to you, we already got SD's tape in there. You know, I just finished with the Migos shit too. 
Just regular shit. You know, Cut out the band though? You still listen to my man, my man Travis. That shit still get played. I feel you. Let's see what else? Oh, no, it's just classic dip set. Dip set. A lot of classic dip set. A lot of fuzzy braid Jim Jones shit. I feel you. Also, let's see. What's five things on Van's bucket list? I have to my bucket list. I know you want to be on Judge Judy. Let's talk about that. Yeah, I, I want to be in the audience one day, just in the cut. You know, I'm trying to figure out how I can do that and wear my snapback for like 10 <laughs> seconds before niggas tell me to take your shit off. I think you 40 y'all should just take over Judge Judy. Like, y'all should be the whole jury. Like, everybody in 40 y'all I need to find somebody to sue. I, I've, been, <laughs> I've been good lately. So I got nobody to sue, but Judge Judy's definitely on top of that. Um, let me see. I want to travel South Africa. I've never been in South Africa. South Africa. There's some dope shit out there. Um, other than that, like, I, I really don't got a bucket list. We live this shit every day. You know how my Monday through Thursday is. Like, yeah. We live, I live so random and spontaneous that it's really hard to say I'm going to do this and not be able to do it. Right. Like, shit, anything's possible. So it's like, my bucket list is infinite, you know? I mean, <laughs> Thanks for coming to chill up town with me for a little bit. Talk about some I love things. It. We're in the hometown of Bronx. I know, I right? Come to the Bronx. We out here. Thanks, man. We out here. Thanks for having me. <laughs> No problem. First round drop piece coming. Who is Mike Jones coming? Slap shining with the grilling woman. Slap shining with the grilling woman. I'm Mike Jones. Who? Mike Jones, the one and only. You can't clone me. Got a lot of haters and a lot of homies. Some friends and some phony. Back then, hoes didn't want me. Now I'm hot, hoes all on me. Back then, hoes.